Away from security matters now, Group Managing Director of the Nigerian National Petroleum Corporation, Meleki Yari, says it will cost about $7 billion, excluding tax and other necessities, to build a new refinery. He made the statement in Abuja while explaining reasons behind the federal government's decision to rehabilitate the Port Accord refinery. Celestine Area reports. The Nigerian National Petroleum Corporation is set to commence the second phase of the rehabilitation of the Port Harcourt refinery in the first quarter of 2021. This is to boot exploration and production with a view of achieving 210,000 barrels per day production target. A lot of commentators on social media and other platforms have questioned why the government will spend $1.5 billion to rehabilitate a refinery when it can easily build a new one. But the group managing director of the NNPC says it will take about four years for a new refinery to be operational and would cost about $7 billion or more. This the country cannot afford as many financial institutions no longer finance projects of this magnitude. The right he noted that the Martinez refinery used by some Nigerians to compare the Port Harcourt refinery was built in 1916. When a refinery is bought, the liabilities of such a refinery is also bought. Now that Martinez refinery was built in the year 1903 or so, 1915, and it is 167,000 barrels per day refinery. It has been on shutdown by the, by the regulators since last year, I think early last year. And not only that, uh, when you buy a refinery, you buy the refinery and the liabilities. And you don't know the liabilities, you don't know the commercial transactions that go into those conversations. So it's really needless to compare a 210,000 barrels for the combined refinery uh, with a much smaller refinery, much older refinery, which has much, much more issues with regulators than we did with our plant. And therefore, you are not dealing with the same, uh, same situation. Absolutely not the same situation. They, you can't compare them. They are not the same thing. And they are very, very different. The Federal Executive Council presided over by President Muhammad Buhari had approved $1.5 billion, approximately 575 billion naira, for the rehabilitation of the 32-year-old refinery. The NNPC says it will put in $200 million from its internally generated revenue sources to finance the project, while the federal appropriation will cost about $800 million. These estimates are broken down into three parts, as the 2020 appropriation will give $350 million. 2021 appropriation will give another $350 million. And 2022 appropriation will give another $100 million, making it all its $100 million. The rest will be financed by the Afri Amazon Bank.